Hey guys, welcome to Outlaw Edge Bladeworks. Um, another video I wanted to do tonight was uh, on WD-40. And I know it's kind of silly, but a lot of people don't know about this. And I've had a, numerous people come in the garage and they're like, where the hell did you get that? And I've seen it at uh, Walmart. I've seen them at, you know, L&M and different places that sell, you know, tractors, supplies like Home Depot and uh, Lowe's and all kinds of tractor supply places and whatever. But WD-40 is usually about 539 or... Uh, you know, six bucks, seven bucks a can, whatever it is, depending on where you're at. And I go through about five of these in a month. And I just go through it like mad. And what I wanted to show you is WD-40 has been doing this for a long time, but I actually just got to where I started doing this. And they had these, these two bottles right here and they're plastic squirt bottles and you can spray a lot out. Like when you're spraying these, they just soak whatever you're trying to, trying to work on. And they have a locking cap so it won't fall off and they're pretty durable. And uh, they're easy to fill and you can get a gallon of WD-40 and both of these for under 20 bucks. I think it was like 17 bucks. I was at L&M and I was going to get a, a case of WD-40 and I saw this and I said, I'm going to try it because I don't care for squirt bottles too much. I'll never buy another one of these now. It's That's a waste of time. It, um, what happens is these end up getting broken. They get dropped. I always knock these nozzles off or this whole head pops off and then the whole can goes in the garbage because it breaks that little white deal off on the top. If you drop one of these, the price of these, they were like three, uh, three bucks for two of them or whatever it was. And I mean, I'm gonna buy like four or five more now just to keep them in the garage. That way if I drop one of them or run them over or break it, who gives a crap? This stuff goes by a gallon. And like I said, 17 bucks or whatever it was, I paid for all this right here compared to buying a whole case of this stuff for 40 or 50 bucks. Or more I forget how many are in a case but I mean it's crazy but uh like I said a lot of people don't realize you can do that and buy WD-40 by the gallon and uh, I like the stuff I like to use it on everything you know in the garage and where I live in Minnesota there's a lot of salt rust and stuff and when I'm working on my cars or motorcycles or you know four-wheel drives or whatever there's a, a stuff gets rusted up and whatever and WD-40 ends up coming through and you, you know I use it on everything and soak it and let it sit overnight and then uh, I use so much of it that's why I chose these uh, squirt bottles. I wanted to try them to see if they work. And I thought I was gonna have problems over the winter uh, with them freezing and stuff like that. And it's been cold here a lot of times and it's, I've never once had a problem with these uh, because I've had these spray bottles freeze up before, but I guess only if they have water or you know soapy water or something like that in them. But anyways, I hope I didn't bore you guys. And uh, if you get a chance, get some WD-40 in the gallons. It'll save you some money. Thanks for watching.